Ammonia is present in surface waters as a consequence of organic matter excreted by animals or man, industrial wastes, agricultural runoffs, as well as a byproduct of the decay of plants and animals. Ammonia is associated with other nitrogen compounds like ammonium ion, nitrite, nitrate, and nitrogen gas, and is a source of fertility for the blue-green algae, a favorite food for aquatic vegetarians. Although associated with water fertility, ammonia is poisonous to fish. Lethal effects are usually observed at concentrations between 100 and 300 parts per billion. Determining the amount of which is expressed as nitrogen ammonia is therefore of utmost importance to the fish culturist. A series of dilutions with increasing known amounts of ammonia nitrogen is first prepared by pipetting increasing volumes of standard ammonia solution. 50 milliliters of the sample water of which the ammonia nitrogen level is being sought is measured either with a 50 milliliter volumetric pipette or a graduated cylinder. Two milliliters of phenol solution is pipetted into each of the standard dilutions and water samples, then shaken. Two milliliters of nitroprusside solution is pipetted into each and then shaken. Lastly, five milliliters of oxidizing solutions is pipetted into each and allowed to stand for about one hour. After one hour, the standard dilutions with increasing known amounts of ammonia nitrogen show increasingly intense blue coloration. The water sample shows varying intensities of blue colorations according to the amounts of ammonia they contain. By visual inspection, we can estimate the amount of ammonia nitrogen our samples contain by comparing them with the standard dilutions. The colorimeter eliminates guesswork because it can tell us exactly how blue the standards and samples are in comparison with pure distilled water treated similarly with chemicals. The colorimeter tells color intensity in terms of percent transmittance. The treated distilled water, which is called blank as it does not contain ammonia, is set to read 100% transmittance. The lower the transmittance reading, the more intense the blue coloration is. Plugging in values into a complicated equation, and with the aid of a calculator, we can compute for the amounts of ammonia nitrogen of our water sample.